So on the 13th of May this year, the market research department here at Forcom took part in the Jurassic Coast Ultra Challenge along the Jurassic Coastline of beautiful Dorset. It was a 34 kilometer adventure that took us up hills, down hills and all around the coastline. There are 11 people um, across the company that participated in this event. Um, we actually ended up raising over four and a half thousand pounds for our charity of choice. Everyone did a little bit of fundraising on their own. So they asked friends, family, co work colleagues, individual members of Fullcom contributed certain amounts and then Fullcom matched what, what we raised as well. I've never actually done anything like this before. So this is my first ultra challenge. I actually didn't expect this walk to be as hard as it actually was. Definitely underestimated the walk and um, yeah, it was very painful. At the beginning of the year, my department um, wanted to choose a charity. Any money that we raised across the year, we were going to raise it for that charity. So we put it to a vote to the team. Hope for Food for us was the most obvious choice. They're a local-based charity. Um, they do a lot of work with local people in, in Bournemouth, Paul and Christchurch, and that for us was kind of a no-brainer. My name is Mary. I'm one of the trustees at uh, Hope for Food. Although we still feed the homeless, we do our two soup kitchens a week. We are now engaged in feeding a lot more families um, who need a lot of help. This has been going on for some time, but obviously been very exacerbated by the cost of living crisis. And unfortunately, we're seeing far more people now who are coming in who are actually in work. These people are really struggling. The sort of things that 4Com have done for us are absolutely essential to our being able to provide help for people and also to keep us sustainable, which is the most important thing. Um, because we rely entirely on donations. We're all volunteers and what that actually means is everything that comes into us goes out to those people who need it. For those brave 11 that walked all the way from Corfe Castle to Weymouth, I just think that is amazing but hopefully they realise that what they've done is an incredible achievement and is actually going to help hundreds of people. So a big thank you. Not for us, not for the charity, not for Hope for Food, because we are only the middleman. And we would say thank you for all of those people that that uh, money that has been raised is going to help.